Former President Trump, he's blasting President Biden's re-election campaign in New Hampshire. Mr. Trump rallying his base for the first time since the president announced that he is also going to seek the Oval Office again. News Nation's Robert Sherman is on the ground in the early voting state, speaking with voters as the 2024 Republican primary race heats up. Good morning, Robert. Good morning to you, Mitch. And this, as we all know, is a key critical state when it comes to the GOP nomination. So it's no surprise the former president was here last night, which he told this crowd here in New Hampshire that he has more work to do. Yes, he acknowledges that the that President Biden is running for reelection, but he says that he intends to win and pick up where he left off in 2020. Listen to this. On Tuesday, Joe Biden officially announced that he will seek four more disastrous years. We are living in a catastrophe. With your vote on November 5th, 2024, we're going to crush Joe Biden and the, the White House, that gorgeous, beautiful White House. We have to take it back. We're going to beat him at the ballot box, and we're going to settle our unfinished business. It's unfinished. Former president taking the time to meet New Hampshire voters after at a local diner. And you understand why? This is one of the most critical states to securing that GOP nomination. And how do things stand right now in the Granite State? Well, if the primary were held today, former President Trump would be sitting at the catbird seat of polled registered Republicans. 42% say they would back the 45th president. Another 29% say they like Florida Governor Ron DeSantis. In a distant third is the New Hampshire Governor Chris Sununu. This is the first address the former president has made since President Biden announced that he will be running for re-election. And you talk to some voters on the ground here, some say they're okay with that rematch. Others say they don't want that to happen. Donald Trump or, or Mr. Biden, I, I don't think they're good choices for Americans right now. I think either one of them's taken us down a, uh, I think it's dangerous for America to keep flip-flopping on its policies. Just a couple weeks ago, Florida Governor Ron DeSantis was here in New Hampshire. Last night, of course, the former president spoke. Ambassador to the U.N. Nikki Haley also here this week. It's April of 2023, but it is heating up as we march towards February of 2024. And that, of course, very important New Hampshire primary. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.